Hey guys, it's Paul Farmer from PaulGFarmer.com and uh, what I want to do today is I want to talk about something that I think is very important and that is taking action. Taking action. I got a quote from uh, Grant Cardone. I got this right out of the 10x rule. Highly recommend that book. Um, I'm actually going to start diving deep, deeper into that book. I've, I've listened to it many times, read it, but I'm going to really start taking some notes and really just diving deep into this thing because really... To be quite honest, everything you possibly need to be successful is outlined in that book. Not the nuts and bolts, so to speak, but the principles. If you follow the principles, that's all you need. So he says every second you th you spend thinking is a second you could have been taking action. Okay, so every second you spend thinking is a second of action that you are wasting. That's the exact quote. Okay, so... Um, you know, this is uh, this is something that you can use for for anything you're doing. Um, what I what I mostly want to address though is either getting started in a business like you haven't joined yet and you're considering joining, or um, you're in a business and you're you're getting going right. You you just joined a business and now it's time to get out there and start promoting the business right. So. Every second you think about doing it, right, is a second of action that you, you waste it. You waste it, right? A second you waste it where you could have been taking action. So, and I know the longer it takes for you to get started, that's, that's, uh, that gives you more time to talk yourself out of doing it, right? So, for example, I started a, a, a new opportunity a little over a month ago. And when I started this opportunity, literally before I was even in the business, I was promoting it. And let me explain that. Uh, basically, I went to one of their hangouts, their team hangouts. I listened to one of their calls. And, you know, I had already kind of looked over some things with the company. I didn't know all the details, but I knew that it was a stable company. I knew it was something I wanted to do. So what I did was I used what I learned on that hangout and I made a post on Facebook this is before I even joined okay because I knew I was going to join but I also knew it took people it takes people time to make a decision it takes people time a lot of time when they see an opportunity they have to see it you know up to seven times before they make a decision so I knew it would take time so I put that post up right away before I was even signed up I hadn't paid for it yet and um what happened was from that post, I signed up quite a few people within the next week or two weeks because I did that post. Now, if I had waited and till I got in the company, waited till I got all my materials, waited till I had my system set up, um, that's the other thing. I didn't have a capture page. All I had was a video that was sent to me, a page with videos that was sent to me. That's it. And uh, I had the sign up page and I ran with it. That's all I did. And I was able to start getting signups right out the gate um, pretty much right away. Pretty much right away. And the reason is because I took action. The reason is I didn't try to figure it all out. I didn't research it for months and months and months and months. Um, I took action. And I've done, I did that in another company as well. There was another company I was in. And uh, I did the same thing. Only this time what I did was I was really interested in this program. And... There was a webinar that was happening so what i did is i went out and i invited people that i knew to the webinar and i go hey you know i just like to know your opinion about this and the people i invited to that webinar all of them joined okay so i got to start that business in profit <laughs> so um it pays to take action it pays to take action it does not pay to be um uh, not take action right um, you know, so many people, I watch so many people uh, sit and research and research and research and think about it and think about it and think about it. And by the time they do make a decision, either they've talked themselves out of it or they do go ahead and get started, yet then they find a reason not to do it and they'll talk themselves out of it again. So the point here is stop thinking, start doing. Of course, you know, do your due diligence. Of course, you don't want to just run around without thinking about anything but my point is take action
You don't have to have everything set up. You don't have, I mean, really, to be honest with you, marketing is so simple. I'm not talking about internet marketing. I'm just talking about networking. It's so freaking simple. You know what you do? Anyone can do this. We got social media. There's, there's, Facebook alone has over a billion people. What do you do? You go out and you reach out to those people. You connect with them and see what their needs are. You offer them a solution if there is a solution. That's it. That's all you got to do. Uh, you put up some posts on Facebook to attract people to you. Motivational posts, business related posts, but not talking about your business, you know, not your business name. But these are just things you can do. Um, ask questions. This will attract people to you. There's more, there's way more to it though, but that is where you can get started, you know. Constantly be adding new friends on Facebook. This is just Facebook. There's other, there's other social media, of course. Constantly be adding friends on Facebook. Connect with those friends. Find out what they're about, what they need. Give them a solution. If it's for them, it's for them. If it's not, it's not. You know, these are simple, simple things. And and people don't do them because they think they need to set everything up. They need to plan everything out. And yes, you need to have a plan, but you know, just get started. Get going. You this all comes together later. At least now you'll have feedback from what's working, what's not working. But if you sit there and plan it all out, try to figure it out, read books forever, watch videos forever, you're never gonna get anywhere. You're you're gonna feel overwhelmed because you're trying to figure so much stuff out you're thinking about it so much believe me i know i understand i've done it anyway that's all i got for today um you know i have a, a coaching group it's called db freedom project you can go to it on facebook um normally i would show you but i'm just going to tell you about it db freedom project we got close to 2700 members in there uh completely free step-by-step -step training check it out my blog paulgfarmer.com um i have training on there I also talk about my wealth vehicle. If you'd like to be a part of something where you can create residual income, residual income, um, and be a part of a team that uh, offers support and guidance like I've never seen before, um, now is the time. Okay, now is the time. Like I just said, take action. You know, every second you think about it is a second you're wasting that you could have been taking action, right? So click the link right below this video. Get to know what it's all about, what our team is about. Like I said, go to my blog, paulgfarmer.com. I got all kinds of material there. Um, my, uh, I got videos about our team, who our team is. You can see who they're about. And I'm telling you, um, I have not. I've been online for over five years. I've been doing this for over five years. And I've never seen anything quite like what I'm seeing right now. So check it out. Uh, take action, right? Take action. Get started, and let's get you going. Let's get you creating that residual income, okay? So thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in the next one.